Hello everyone, and welcome to my young and restless gossip channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Sharon's startling discovery about Cameron's harsh reality is revealed. According to spoilers for Monday, September 16th, episode of The Young and the Restless, Sharon Newman is going to take a big chance by talking to Cameron Kirsten in the coffee shop where anybody could see her strange behavior. Sharon will have a heated conversation with Cameron when they are sitting on the terrace, acting as though they are in person. In Monday's YNR episode, he will press Sharon to embrace the fact that Cameron is, of course, all in her head. Cameron will tell Sharon that he's only an expression of her spiteful desires when she berates him for the repulsive concept he suggested. Cameron will sense that Sharon needs to quit acting as though she is totally detached from his thoughts. The hard truth is that Cameron will push Sharon to accept the fact that she harbors a desire for Daniel Romilotti Jr.'s death. Cameron will prod Sharon once more to realize that her life would be better off without Daniel. Will Nick Newman, Faith Newman, Mariah Copeland, or another character see Sharon chatting with an absentee? If true, that would give rise to even more concerns over Sharon's mental health. According to additional Young and the Restless spoilers, Connor Newman won't be overly upset by Adam Newman and Sally Spectra's breakup. This is due to Connor's perception that Adam and Chelsea Lawson are the ones who truly have a special bond. Even while Connor doesn't intend to play matchmaker, we'll see the first indications that he might unintentionally step in as Cupid. Connor won't be pulling off a parent trap, but he might be forthcoming about how much he's been enjoying their quality time together lately. Connor might say that, especially since Chelsea and Adam are no longer together, it would be good to be a single family once more. Chelsea is going to uncover something uncomfortable eventually. Chelsea appears to be listening in on Connor and Adam's talk, which will make her aware that Connor might know something she's been attempting to hide. In an attempt to mend the rift with Billy Abbott, Chelsea has been downplaying her relationship with Adam. Now that their split is public, Chelsea has no motive to do that, Therefore, she might be more forthcoming with herself about any unresolved emotions. Adam and Chelsea will have to think about what a true reunion might entail. We think that Chelsea and Adam might reconcile in the future, so stay tuned for more updates on the possible impact of this revelation. Stay tuned as previews for the young and the restless indicate that Adam and Chelsea will have a lot to learn. Sharon's horrible thought Connor encourages Adam and Chelsea to reunite. A first peek at the young and the restless teasers for the week of September 16th to 20th indicates that Phyllis Summers will be sulking over some very important news. When Phyllis convinces Billy Abbott to hire her, she'll gloatingly introduce herself to Lily Winters as the new COO of Abbott Chancellor. In the recently released promotional video, Lily responds with a wow, so she will be really shocked when Billy keeps making poor choices. Lily might guess that Billy will expedite the company's demise because Phyllis always creates havoc wherever she goes. Lily naturally wants to step in before that occurs, but Victor Newman appears ready to deceive her and heighten the drama in this situation. Let's discuss Connor Newman's response to Adam Newman and Sally Spectra's breakup in the interim. Connor's reaction to Sally and Adam's breakup will likely surprise his parents. Even though Connor will admit that Adam and Sally made a wonderful couple, he will believe that his father's relationship with Chelsea Lawson was more meaningful. Chelsea will probably listen in and begin to question whether Connor might be correct. Since Adam and Chelsea have a lasting love, is there any possibility that they were destined to be together from the beginning? Sharon Newman and Cameron Kirsten will then engage in a dangerous public altercation. Will someone notice Sharon's worrisome one-sided discussion with Cameron on the Crimson Lights patio as YNR teasers claim? In any event, Sharon will confront Cameron for trying to influence her to kill Daniel Romilotti Jr. by making offensive suggestions. Cameron won't agree because Sharon came up with the idea on her own. Cameron will argue that the concept belongs to Sharon since it's not like he's talking to her in real life. Consequently, Cameron will exhort Sharon to accept her dark side and embrace it as the only way to get closure for Cassie Newman. Cameron will act as though that could still be the solution to all of Sharon's issues because she lately had dreams of a happier existence in which Daniel had passed away. Cassie cannot be brought back, 
but Cameron can argue that if Daniel bears the cost, Sharon will be able to let go at last. Stay in for more on all the Daniel danger, as spoilers for The Young and The Restless indicate that Sharon will be a complete emotional mess. CDL is expected to provide additional sultry young and the restless spoilers. There's every reason for Mariah to be concerned about Sharon. Things haven't been going well for Sharon Newman, as many viewers of the young and the restless are already aware of, and therefore, her family is quite worried. There's every reason for Mariah to be concerned about Sharon. Mariah is one person who has been attempting to comprehend the reality about her mother. Fortunately, Mariah, played by actress Cameron Grimes on the popular CBS soap opera, talked openly about her love for her mother. In a recent interview with Soap Opera Digest, Cameron expressed her understanding of Sharon's current situation, particularly in light of Faith's automobile tragedy with Lucy. I believe that Mariah will always give Sharon the benefit of the doubt because she was not privy to her sort of worst period of time with her mental illness and episodes, the actress stated. She's always going to err on the side of the devil's advocate and want to really believe in her mom. Spoilers for the young and the restless, however, claim that Sharon continues to make reasons for not taking care of herself, just as she did the first time she skipped the spa. In a sneak peek, Cameron says, any flip-flopping is going to be a bit of a red flag because Nick, Faith, Mariah, and Sharon had sort of discussed this plan for her moving forward and her getting herself help. What is Sharon Newman's future plan? There are things that are going to make her, for somebody as consistent as Sharon, it's obviously going to raise at least a little bit of an alarm for Mariah, but neither she nor anyone else understands the depth of how far this is going for Sharon. At that point, Mariah and Nick had a crucial chat regarding the issue. She is approaching from an entirely different angle than Nick. Although it's clear that she didn't want to assume the worst, her curiosity and worry have undoubtedly been aroused. Additionally, they agree on Sharon's resolve to prevent Faith from seeing Lucy. Please share your opinions with us by writing a note in the space provided below for comments. According to spoilers for Monday, September 16th, episode of The Young and the Restless, Sharon Newman is going to take a big chance by talking to Cameron Kirsten in the coffee shop, where anybody could see her strange behavior. Sharon will have a heated conversation with Cameron when they're sitting on the terrace, acting as though they are in person. In Monday's YNR episode, he will press Sharon to embrace the fact that Cameron is, of course, all in her head. Cameron will tell Sharon that he's only an expression of her spiteful desires when she berates him for the repulsive concept he suggested. Cameron will sense that Sharon needs to quit acting as though she is totally detached from his thoughts. The hard truth is that Cameron will push Sharon to accept the fact that she harbors a desire for Daniel Romilotti Jr.'s death. Cameron will prod Sharon once more to realize that her life would be better off without Daniel. Well, Nick Newman, thanks for watching if you like this video. So please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any update.